guys, Nickel Ruggers here, and today I am back for another episode of Minigame Monday. This time we'll be playing survival games. Now, if I need to explain what survival games is, you really shouldn't be on this channel by now. Anyway, the idea is it's basically the Hunger Games. There are a bunch of loot chests scattered around. You have to run around, find them, grab them, grab all the loot you can to kill everybody else. Basically, Sky Wars, but on land. So, it's, it's, it's pretty cool. Um... But another thing, which is slightly more exciting, you might notice, at the top of the screen, absolutely nothing out of ordinary. And that is exactly correct. I now have a recording sys software, a recording system, that allows me, oh, I apologize there, to have a little blank space up there, so there's nothing there anymore. There's nothing there, it's completely free, you'll know what I'm talking about if you've seen uh, some of my other videos, but anyway, let's just jump straight into it. So we are in the lobby, we are in the lobby, this is starting, there are a bunch of kits, I would rather there weren't, um, and I haven't played much of this, I in fact have played when, I have played a couple rounds, but that was really long ago, so I'm just kind of, I'm, I'm on my own, I haven't unlocked any kits it looks like, except Axeman, which I apparently have, I think that means I can throw axes. Okay, now, you guys know. I am not the best at PvP, so I'm just gonna have to run this way. Oh, and my volume's terrible as well. Oh no, it's still set on low. Still really low. You guys won't be able to hear anything that's going on uh, from the actual game. So I'm gonna just, like, kinda sidle around this way. And sprint off this way. I think it's um, that you get a bunch of speed, and if you hit somebody, you lose your speed benefit. So people can escape easier. I think someone else is right behind us. So that's not good. Uh, grab, 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 grab. I doubt that I'm gonna need the rotten flesh, but right now I'm not bothering organizing anything. I'm just gonna take what I can and go. Get right out of dodge. Okay. Alright, so, first things first. Vomit some rotten flesh onto the doorway. It's people who eat it, they're, they're gonna come in and they're gonna slip on it. Um, chest back here. Golden leggings. Take that and throw it out for privatization's sake. That why is everything like written as though it was renamed? Uh put that there, 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 and there. Alright, we're all set. We don't have a weapon yet. That's I was going to say totally fine. It's really not. In fact, let me turn my volume up. Music and sound, set that up to fifty percent. Oh, first click, like a boss. Alright. We're on the run again. The thing about the Hunger Games, you can never stop moving. If you stand still for too long, bad things happen. Oh, that's right, plugins. <laughs> I'm just gonna. Ah, oh, throw that out. There and there. Because I can throw axes. It's a special, awesome ability. Thing is, I don't know whether I can pick them up after I throw them, so I'm gonna keep this stone one for throwing and the iron one for actually killing people. And I'll keep that out too. Uh, I don't, I don't know, think I'll need a boat. I don't know if there's any water. I, again, I have actually, like, not played much of this, so I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh, that guy's gonna shiv me if he sees me. I hope he had, I hope he didn't. Did he? Okay, it looks like I'm safe. Good lord. He's running through mud, all the soul sand here. This is annoying. Oh, hey, you know what you were saying about, I don't know whether or not they have any water on this map? Well, they do. No, 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 no. I'm pretty sure I could have swum faster than this. Nope, I give up. Yep. This is just infinitely better, what can I say? Never use boats, ladies and gentlemen. Just swim. Anyway, alright. I kinda want- I don't- I don't wanna cut out anything for this one, so you're just gonna have to watch- I'm afraid you're gonna have to watch the whole thing. Um. Oh, hi, Steve. How are you? Are, are you alright, buddy? Buddy? Anyway, I don't want to cut out anything because, you know, you don't know when you're going to die. Oh, I did not. Okay, this is the border of the map. I'm out. Because <laughs> it said in the tips, like, avoid the border. Uh, one of the tips it had. And again, I was like, well, hmm, wonder, where's the border? And I hear, whoop, whoop, whoop. And I'm like, well, this is the border. That's that's why you would avoid it. It's just... So, Yeah. Where are we going for? I feel like everything has been looted by now, and everybody else will ha Oh, bollocks, I accidentally threw my axe. Well, now we know that you don't retrieve it, and that I can't hold it. Grab that. 
Uh, the wood sword. Uh, I'm gonna guess that it's 1.8 PvP. I hope. Um, alright. Step along the back. Nothing, nothing. Alright. So, 15 tributes left. What district are we from? Judging by the fact that we're... What is it? Is it like District 8 that does all the timber and the wood and the stuff like that? I am almost guarantee that I'm wrong. But whichever one does that, that's what district we're from. The way we're axe throwers. and get pro with the one thing we know how to use. And we have actually a lot of wooden weapons as well. So I have a sword, and that's my constant weapon. I have an axe, and I, that's my throwing weapon. And I have another axe, that's my other throwing weapon. Uh, I think chain is better than both gold and leather. I think it might actually be equal with gold, but, you know. Whatever. Oh, whew. Uh, 13 tributes. We've managed to survive. I think it began off with 24, right? Yeah, because there's 12 districts that haven't been nuked. And each one puts out their two tributes, male and female. Um, alright. Just leads out again. This leads absolutely nowhere. I'm just see the chat, it's just people are just dropping like flies. They should have it that, like, you have the cannon noise every time someone dies, and it, like, follows you. Because I remember there used to be, I, what was it? I forgot what server it was, but it used to be a server where you, I used to play survival games, and it would say, a cannon can be heard in the distance in the chat. It would be really cool if you actually had, like, the lightning sound, so it would be like, <laughs> apologies if that caused a mic spike. It would not actually make, like, a big rolling boom. That would be great. We're actually not doing so badly. The only thing I'm worried about is that other people will have a lot better gear than us. Because we aren't doing so badly ourselves. Okay, and armor doesn't have durability, so we should be fine. Uh, don't know what that was, but it sounded very, very threatening. <laughs> we just have like a million axes in our inventory. If anybody, in fact, why don't we move those all down? And then, you know, if someone comes out and we see them at a distance, they maybe have a bow, we can just open fire into them with axes and we'll be fine. Around the side. Whoo! All right. Stick. Ow! 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 Go away, you punk! Oh! Oh no! Oh, this is not good. I think he's throwing axes as well. I don't give a fudge. Someone says, but I love fudge. Fudge is delicious. We've been spending all this time getting all our stuff, and now we're about to get destroyed. Oh, that was disappointing. Anyway, guys, that was uh, Survival Games on the Mindplex server. As always, there will be a link to the, or rather, the server IP in the description if you'd like to play for yourself. And I think that does it for this episode. If you guys enjoyed as much as I did, and despite the fact that I was murdered, I did, in fact, enjoy... Um, if you guys enjoyed, please leave a like, leave a comment, and as always, if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing, because your support means a lot. Anyway, I guess that's it, and I will see you all in the next Minigame Monday.